Good morning. It is uh, Sunday, April 18th. It's a little after 7 a.m. Uh, we're going to do a kayak paddle today. Uh, we're going to circumnavigate uh, Ball Island in, uh, in Hoboken, Pamlico County, North Carolina. So, uh, it's about a 13 mile paddle. Um, the winds today, five to 10 knots out of the northeast, uh, becoming east late. We're gonna launch at R.E. Mayo Seafood. Uh, they have a launching ramp there. Um, we're gonna paddle two miles down the intercoastal waterway, uh, south down the intercoastal waterway into Gales Creek. paddle about a mile uh, east or south southeast in Gales Creek to the Bay River uh, then we're gonna paddle um, east southeast about three and a half miles in the Bay River to the Pamlico Sound uh, and then two miles north in the Pamlico Sound to Jones Bay and then five miles northwest back to the launch point. So it's a little over 13 miles. Uh, it's a little cool this morning, shaping up to be a pretty day. It's supposed to be a high in the uh, low 70s. Uh, it's probably high 40s right now. It's Ball Island. We're gonna we're gonna paddle around Ball Island. Is, is uh, what it's locally known as. So uh, we're uh, getting close to the launch site. So in Hoboken. So uh, we'll see you on the water. Here we are. Are you may seafood in Hoboken? This is the launch. Hey. We're here, the launch site. Man. It's five dollars to launch. It's in the honor system type deal. There you go. Uh, right here on the intercoastal waterway. So, all right, let's get on it. Alrighty, we're out of here. Beautiful morning. Ball Island right here. Uh, get a little distance under our belt and we'll check back in with So we're a little over a mile into it here, still in the uh, intercoastal waterway canal. You can see it's, uh, I don't know, eighth of a mile wide down the canal. Um, there are some really, really big boats that come up and down the intercoastal waterway, so I'd Probably recommend a little bigger boat, something at least 15, 16 feet on up. It could certainly be done in a smaller boat, but uh, there is uh, some big boats make big wakes, uh, as well as this little, I'd probably classify this as. Um, somewhat of an open water paddle 
certainly in places. You got the mouth of the Bay River and certainly the Pamlico Sound uh, and then Jones Bay uh, all relatively open water so recommend something a little bit bigger if you've got it uh, pay attention to your winds and uh, should be okay you can see the mouth of Gales Creek up ahead channel markers so we'll give you another shout out when we get up here all right so we've got uh, two miles under our under our belt here made the turn to the southeast entering Gales Creek uh, just did two miles down the uh, intercoastal uh, down the canal uh, but it's a beautiful morning quiet calm winds uh, we've got about a mile run in Gales Creek to uh, the Bay River and then we're going to head uh, east southeast for about a little over three and a half miles in the bay river so to the pamlico sound so. beautiful morning beautiful morning pamlico county all right so we're a little over three miles here we're uh just entered the Bay River. Um, Going to head east southeast, about three and a half miles to the Pamlico Sound. All righty. We're uh, about a mile and a half from the Pamlico Sound, exiting the Bay River. Not sure if you can pick it up. It's about a mile and a half. There's a point dead ahead of us that we're going to round. That's Bay Point. And uh, we're going to round that, head off to the north northeast for a couple of mile run in the uh, Famico Sound. So the last couple of legs are going to be into the wind, but there is of it. It's trying to build. Um, Noose River, Bay River, Pamlico Sound. Usually at 10 or 11 o'clock, there's a switch that flips and the breeze just turns on. So you can see the breeze building out of the we're headed east southeast you can see the uh, breeze building out of the north over here already uh, this is more of an open water paddle those that uh, really enjoy wildlife spotting and bird watching and and it's probably not the greatest paddle for that, although there is, uh, you can see some uh, porpoises out here. Um, but, uh, you know, and some osprey on occasion. But this is more of an open water paddle. Um, for those that want to spend a morning or, or an afternoon getting their adventure paddle on. Getting their Lewis and Clark on for a few hours. There's a lot of other great areas, paddles for uh, wildlife watching, bird watching, you know, close by. 
All right, just thought I'd check in with you. Breeze has gotten to us. All right, we'll get back with you in another couple miles or so. We're uh, an hour and a half into it now. Okay. A little over five and a half miles. Check back with you in a few. We have made the turn to the north northeast here in the Pamlico Sound. Just left the Bay River back behind us. We've got about a just about a two mile run. And then we'll uh, hang a left to the west, northwest in Jones Bay. About a five, six mile run up Jones Bay. Beautiful day. This is a great paddle. Anything. Uh, from light to light and variable winds to five to ten knots like it is today. Uh, perfect place. Perfect paddle for that. You start getting to ten to fifteen in the open water. There's so much miles and miles and miles of open water for the waves to build. Although there's not a lot of wind at 10 to 15 um, there is uh, the Pamlico Sound and the mouth of these rivers feeding the Pamlico Sound are so shallow uh, the waves are can build quickly and they're uh, in rapid succession so just something to be aware of if you come into pamlico county and want to paddle um have you several paddles mapped out okay. just just go uh pick you out a uh, a paddle that's uh more conducive to the winds that you're going to have like it's going to be coming down in a month or so you, you obviously don't know what the weather's going to be like but you can have several paddles mapped out you know an, an upper river paddle where it's really really sheltered if you're going to have you know 10 15 to maybe 20 miles an hour uh 20 mile an hour winds it's going to be light and variable to maybe five to ten knots at the most pick you out an open water paddle but uh, have options. Have options. Just thought I'd share that with you. Uh. All right. Pamlico Sound. We'll uh, get back with you shortly. All right. Seven and a half miles. About a little less than two hours here. See the Boar Point, B O A R, Boar Point up ahead. That's where we're gonna hang a left to the northwest. Uh, just thought I'd give you a look at that. Breeze is slowly building. Slowly building. Probably six to eight knots. Making the turn into Jones Bay here. A lot of duck blinds on Ball Island. A lot of duck blinds. There. Bald eagle perched on that duck blind.
what did I just say about not spotting any wildlife. How beautiful is that? There he goes. Shucks. I can actually see the uh, Hoboken Bridge up ahead of us. It's about five miles up there. Dead ahead of us is uh, Maiden Point. M-A-I-D-E-N, Maiden Point. Not sure how well you can see it. There's a duck blind on it. Probably three quarters of a mile up there. The uh, breeze is filled in nicely. About six knots or so. When you get a really strong wind coming across a bay like this, go to the lee shore. Uh, in this instance, the right bank over there. You get a lot of protection. You've got a, you know, a six, eight mile paddle up a bay or river. If it's a really strong wind, I mean, this is a, a pleasant breeze, but if it's a white capping and rough, get in the lee of the land. Might have to paddle a half a mile or a mile into the wind but it'll afford you a lot of protection so not a lot of getting out and stretching your legs on a paddle like this you can get out you gotta pick your spots a marsh area if you really really need to otherwise just squirm Squirm in your seat and get to where you go. All right, checking in. We'll get back with you shortly. There's the launch site. Are you mayo's seafood? Dead ahead of us. Twelve and a half miles so far. Looks like we're going to be just shy of thirteen miles. But here we are, Intercoastal Waterway. This boat here is uh, headed north on the Intercoastal. Y'all come on down to Pamlico County. Get your paddle on. Thank y'all for watching. I really do appreciate it.